Has Been Hotel, Episode 4, Masquerade, is directed by Vivian Medrano. Angel struggles to juggle his work and his time at the hotel. Charlie decides it's time to put her princess status to use with Angel Dust's boss. Now, so far I enjoyed all the episodes. Some I like better than others, obviously. But this episode is the one I was interested in the most. Mostly because it's going to be focused on Angel Dust. And he is one of my favorite characters from the pilot. And so far in the series, he's been a side character, having a few important moments here and there of character growth. But overall, he's just a side character to help progress Charlie's story. Here, he is the main focus. We get to see what his life is like, how shitty it is, and we get to see how his boss treats him really unfairly and downright criminal. And you get to see how that basically affects the way he interacts with others, how he treats himself when he's not in a porn video screen. And it's quite sad, honestly, to see uh, this taking a negative effect on him. And I think the way it was explored here, while definitely cartoonish in a few ways, especially in ex especially when it comes to the character of Valentino, like the way he treats him is very exaggerative. I think the overall message and tone and feel of the episode felt nice because it never needed to be serious. It stayed serious and lingers on these moments just long enough to get that impact. And how that affects Charlie's viewpoint on having everyone be able to easily come to her hotel without any problems. I just found that to be a nice little bit of character growth for her. As nothing is going to come easy with running this hotel. Many of these characters have other side hustles that affect their time at the hotel. And I think having Charlie learn that the hard way and make some mistakes to try and have everything become her way, I think was, was nice and very much needed for a character to grow from here and to strengthen the relationship between Charlie and Angel does to have them understand each other more. But in the later half of the episode, we focus on Husk a lot. Earlier in the episode, we see him basically call everyone out on their BES, telling everyone who they really are when they come to him at the bar. And then he points at Angel Dust as being a fake. And what he does is mostly a persona to try and hide how he truly feels inside. Then later on in the episode, by the end, with this musical number, Losers, these two characters start to express themselves, tell each other about who they are. Husk tells a story about how he was a uh, higher up in hell, and then unfortunately had to make a lot of bad deals, especially with one red demon to try and stay afloat. I found that to be really compelling and it mirrors Angel Dust character very well and in this way these two characters are able to form a stronger bond, become better pals, the musical number slaps and everything strengthen their characters and the episode was at least able to end at a bit of a nice little note there. Overall, I found this episode to be my favorite. It has the most compelling story, it had the best music, especially Poison. Poison is a really good song and the way it was staged here and animated, perfect. I really dug the way this song was portrayed in the episode. So overall, I would definitely recommend this one. It's so far my favorite episode of the series and I cannot wait to see what episode 5 has in store. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys next time.